Hello Thinksters! Today we'll take a look at an improvement of the previously described depth first search algorithm called Iterative Deepening Depth First Search Algorithm, or in short, just IDDFS. IDDFS is a hybrid of the depth first search algorithm and the breadth first search algorithm in that it visits the vertices by going depth first but only to a progressively limited depth, producing a vertice traversal order similar to the breadth first search algorithm. As usual, we'll start with vertex 5 and look for the vertex 6. Here on the right side, you can follow the algorithm's output as it runs. The beginning search depth is set to 0, so now we're not really moving away from uh, the starting vertex. Each iteration's reach is marked by this red line, meaning that uh, uh, whenever the algorithm goes in terms of uh, however far it goes, it will never cross this red line, this one here. So uh, let's start. Uh, since we're working with search depth 0, this is the only vertex we're actually going to visit and our iteration ends right now. In this iteration, uh, with search depth 1, we'll go one step further, constraining the search with a depth of 1. The maximum reach of uh, a potential path is marked with circular endings uh, on each edge, as you can see here and here. Let's start with the vertex 5. Uh, the next vertex is 3. We can't go any further and we're coming back to 5. We'll proceed to 0 and since we also have reached the limit we're going back and this iteration also ended. In the next iteration with search depth of 2 we'll also start with 5. Uh, you can see uh, the vertex 8 is uh, crossed, it's easier to draw it this way. It means that uh, it is not included in, in all the other vertices marked by this red line. So we're starting with uh, 5, going to, zero, uh, to 3, sorry, uh, then proceeding to 4. We have reached our search depth limit and now we're coming back to 3, to 5, proceeding to 0. Uh, proceeding to 1. There are no other vertices uh, following 1, so we're coming back to 0. Uh, following with vertex 2, we cannot go any further, so we're also going back to 0, to 5, and uh, uh, sorry, not to 5, to 4. We haven't visited 4 before, but uh, now that we have, we cannot go any further. We're returning to 0, to 5, and this iteration also ends. Uh, in the next iteration, with search depth 3, we have also included uh, vertex 6, and uh, let's start uh, the search algorithm. We're starting with 5, going to 3, to 4, and this time one step further to 0. Uh, we cannot go any further, as indicated by this circle, on this edge, on this path, so we're coming back to 4, to 3, to 5, and now let's explore 0. In the next step, we're going to vertex 1. We cannot go any further, so we went back to 0. We're trying again with 2, and this time we'll go one step further, and we'll find our vertex 6, and being this uh, the vertex we are actually looking for, uh, we can finish our uh, iteration and actually finish the algorithm and just mark uh, the shortest search path because uh, the IDDFS produces the shortest search path and uh, now we have our uh, search path uh, containing 5, 0, 2 and 6. I hope you had fun learning from this article and the video as much as I did making it and until next time, see you, bye bye.